tags to an article in Joomla. And you can see I'm in the article manager. And um, I'm going to just select an article. This one happens to be a review of, the, of a book. And I'm going to click on the title of the review. And then I'm going to um, look at the text a little bit to think about what would be appropriate to put in this metadata area on the right, which allows you to put a description and a keyword in. Now Google and all the search engines pretty much do pay attention to description meta tag at the time of making this video. And Yahoo is currently looking at keywords, uh, but Google isn't. The description is going to be what shows up when you do a Google search um, under the link. And the keywords don't show up anywhere, they're hidden. Um, and which is one reason why uh, many browser, many search engines don't pay attention to them. But the description is very important and you want it to have information that's on the page, visible to viewers, as well as um, you want it to have keywords that are relevant for the page. So looking at this one, it says, this is a truly special book, a poetic memoir that explores a child's experience with the death of a parent and later bullying by a classmate. So there are several things here that might attract somebody, say, searching for bullying by a classmate. And that's what you want to have in your mind, is what might people be searching for who might be interested in this book. So I'm just going to take the first sentence and copy it. And I've noticed there's an extra space here, so I'm just going to click delete. And I'm going to paste that text here in the description tag by choosing edit, paste, whatever works best for you. Of course, because I'm making a video, mm, Firefox has slowed way down. So I think, you know, poetic memoir is a possibility. Somebody would be uh, exploring that, bullying by a classmate. So I think we can use those phrases. So I'm going to put them in the um, in the keywords. Bullying classmate. You can leave out in the keywords. You can leave out by articles like by and a. Uh. Okay, so that's really what you've done. You've added a descriptive meta tag and a keyword meta tag, and you save it. And then I'll move on to. Uh, like a different kind. This one is the history of the book. And I'll click on the title for the article. And I'm going to think about what's going to go well in the meta tags as far as people searching for this is a Jewish book. And we know that Jewish book is a good keyword. Jewish memoir is a good keyword. Uh, so this is where the author discusses her process of writing her memoir. So you might want to put a little quote from the page because that's, that's a quick way to do it. Uh, and put her name maybe. Jean started with a blank page words formed randomly across formidable space pulling back this child who was this pulling back this child who was done. And then take out the rest and say, enjoy learning about the process of writing this Jewish memoir. And because people might be searching for a Jewish memoir. All right, Jean started with a blank page, words formed randomly across formidable space, you know, nice poetic quote. Does nothing wrong with doing something poetic in the descriptive meta tag. Uh, enjoy learning about the process of writing about Jean's, I know we use our name several times, but process of writing this poignant, you know, just give it a little interest, Jewish memoir. Okay, so, so we've got some keywords in here, right? Jewish memoir, we've got one keyword in here, Jewish memoir, that's fine, you don't have to go crazy. And if you put a keyword in the keyword meta tag, 
Don't do more than three, but you would separate them with commas. You don't need capitals. It's best not to use capitals on the keywords. And then you save it. So essentially, you are, you know, you're writing the text. Like if I were to put, um, do a search in Google for something and the results came up, uh, then you would, you would see the link to the page and then you would see that descriptive meta tag that you put here. And that's very important for search engines. So enjoy adding meta tags to your Joomla article.